Now, reports from Migori also indicate that one person was shot as some protesters barricaded roads there. Our political affairs editor Ben Kitili joins us now from Migori. Migori. Ben, what's the situ situation in Migori right now? Good evening, Yvonne. It is a calm night here in Migori County. Uh, it was not so calm earlier in the day, as you correctly mentioned there. Uh, it was a day characterized by running battles between uh, youth, mostly NASA supporters, and anti-riot police. Uh, what is right behind me is the highway that runs through Migori town all the way to Sirari, near the Tanzanian border. Now, this road has been impossible, impossible for the better part of the day. Um, we got into Migori in the morning. Now, from Awendo town, just a few kilometers back, it's about five kilometers to Migori town, but it took us about two hours to get to this town with a placard waving and tire burning youth uh, blockade, uh, erecting blockades along this uh, highway, uh, dozens of blockades, and it takes a lot of time and negotiating to get through that. And basically that is what uh, was the major bone of contention with the police uh, trying to unblock the roads. And every time they did that, you know, many contingents of, of, the, of the general service units, uh, the youth would come back again despite the tear gas and, 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 erect, and erect the blockades uh, once more. So, so that, was, that is what was happening for the entire, uh, for the better part of the day. Uh, yesterday, as well as youth, uh, you know, tried to run the police out of town. And what they are saying basically is they want to make it very difficult for the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission officials tomorrow to move ballot uh, materials from their central location in Migori County to the different polling stations across the constituencies. That is what they were trying to do. And it was not um, it's so good. Uh, two people were injured. Uh, one of them seriously and uh, was admitted was uh, to the Oruba nursing home with a serious gunshot wound. And uh, that, uh, that has not uh, gone down very well with the, with the people here. So tomorrow morning we'll be up early to try and take a look at what's happening in the polling stations here in Suna East and Suna West in Migori Town and across also all the other constituencies around to just find out what will be happening. Will there be voting or not? Back to you, Yvonne. Yeah, that's right. Thanks very much for that, Ben. Kitili will definitely.